Okay, so all ready to go everything set up, start the lathe up, engage our feed nut, cutting the fair like the yard cutting, certainly cutting something. Once the tool comes clear, disengage the clutch, cross slide, take that in so the tool is disengaged from the thread, stop the lathe, reverse it, restart it. And that will wind back through without, without touching the fair I've already cut. Watching for it coming through. There it is. Stop the lathe. Wind out, our cross state is zero, a little bit more cut on the one of the mill this time. Reverse the lathe again. You've got to adopt the same procedure every time and do it the same way every time or you'll make a mistake. One mistake and the job scrap. Okay, so put some cut on, put wind back one, cross slide to zero. A little bit of cut on, reverse my lathe, right we will go up, Going back in there, clearing the threads, disengage some of the threads, totally missing them. I've got to reverse the lathe, that's how easy it is. That stop with the funnies here hitting that chuck.
nice sharp thread in there. It's actually starting, but it's nowhere near going on us. Quite a bit more to come out of it yet. This anchor loop soon be helping his grunts to cut nice and freely. I've just stopped the end of the tool, I don't know why. Bollocks. This is not very good at all, this. It snapped off in there. What a twat. What a bastard. Aye, I'm going to make another tool and try, and try and pick the thread up, which is not going to be easy. Aye, I've ground up another tool. It's a tip boring tool I had. I think a screw was a... That was a whipwash screw cutting tool. I've reprofiled that so it's going to cut acne thread. I've got it all set up, John Sand 8, it's square to the job, and I can't slide it in and out of the tool post like that. But what I'm going to try and do is pick up the thread, so I'll set the lay of the way with the tool coming out, and if I move that in and engage it in one of the threads, hopefully it'll pick the thread up in the correct place and I can carry on screw cutting it. Anyway, I'll start the lathe up, I'll run the tool out a little bit and then we'll try and line that up into one of the threads. Engage that in that thread like that. It actually feels good that. Just going to tighten it all up. Zero our cross thread again. Disengage it from the threads, I'll screw it in and then put a cut on so exactly what's going to happen. scratching the bottom there. That's pretty good. Go back on track again.
I'm going to tore off that. It's actually, it's actually starting there. It's going in. What I'll do, I'll do one more cut in exactly the same setting, just a spring pass. taking a decent cut just on the, the spring of the tool That's nice, that's screwing in just nice. I think I've managed to pull myself out of shape with that, so we'll leave it at that. Very happy with that. 